guys, what's up? It's Mrs. Solis here. I just wanted to talk to you about some swag sentences. Welcome to my crib. Hi guys, welcome to my crib. Okay, so I know that a lot of you are rock star writers, which is awesome, but have you stepped it up a, a notch to swag writers? That's S-W-A-G, swag. Let me tell you how. Look at this sentence. Is that a swag sentence? Can you see the spaces, the capitals? Mm, no, and it, the writing looks like poo. Let's try again. That sentence is not swaggy at all. But boom, a look at that second sentence. It starts with the capital. There are spaces. It's written nicely. Let's talk about swag, okay? Starts with a capital. Even after a period, I have a capital. After every period and every sentence, I need to put capitals. If there's names, person, place, thing, they all need capitals. W, we need to write it nicely. Is this written nicely? Oh yeah, it's a lot better than that. A, make sure there's a space between your words. If they're run together like this, we can't read it. Oh my goodness. And G, give it punctuation at the end. Look at your sentence and decide what kind of punctuation it needs. Mine need an exclamation point because Mrs. Solis's class is the best. Guys, thanks for joining me today on my crib, learning about swag sentences. I hope you have a great day. Peace.